the actual definition of continuity, I used it but didn't tell you about it on the previous example. So this is the definition, the con continuity at a point or an x value inside the domain of a function. If your x value is not in the domain, none of this makes sense. Uh, if your function is continuous at x equals a exactly when the limit equals the value. And so we can summarize this by just saying when the limit equals the value. And that make, may make more sense on your note page when the limit equals the value. Alternative version I wrote here because we have a left limit from negative land if that equals the right limit and those need to agree, they need to be equal, and that needs to equal the value. So in these two different versions, this one just says limit equals value because the limit is assumed to be a left and a right from both sides. And on this second version right here, I just separated it out, and you got the left limit equals the right limit equals the value. And again, if you remember back to limits, when your left equals your right limit, that means your limit exists. So this is probably one of the most important concepts for the section is definition of continuity. And we're gonna see some implications and examples next.